Hello, welcome back to Steve's Retirement Corner. Retirement practice. That's the stage I'm in right now. I'm on vacation, so I'm practicing. I'm trying to get my routine down for when I do go. Hmm. I tell you, if it's going to be anything like this, I'm ready to go. <laughs> so far, my routine's working out pretty good. Been taking my afternoon nap. <laughs> <laughs> I got a little bit planned to do today. Nothing forcing. Ain't nothing I'll be there at no 8 o'clock for, 9 o'clock for, or whatever. Whenever I show up. So, but I think it's important. In order to get good at anything, you need to practice. You can't just stop working 40, 50, 60 hours a week. Cold turkey. You got to take your time. You got to ease yourself into it. I think that's important. And um, you should have an idea of a routine before you uh, before you step out. Now, a routine is not something you're locked into. It's changeable. You can do it any time to suit your needs if it changes, and they'll change over years. And, uh, you know, but you, you practice anything, you get better at it. You, know, you might have to adapt how you do it. But... <clears throat> Practice is, practice is important for it. It really is. I've heard too many stories about people retiring, getting depressed, just sitting around dying a couple years after they retire. And I always thought that was a shame. Work all them years, get you a few moments to retire, and that's it. That's why I don't see the need behind it. Stay until the very end. I really don't. First off, I guess people think they always got more time than they do. And time gets short once you get 60 years old. You need to make the most of that time. Quit having to answer to the man. You know, do what you feel like when you feel like it. You know, I know it's not possible for everybody, but it's possible for everybody to strive to get there. So... Yeah, I, well, I've only been practicing this this time for a couple of days, what, four or five days now. I still got another 10, 15 days left. <laughs> Maybe by the end of the, end of the time, I'll, I'll have it down. <laughs> but I got another vacation coming up here in a little while. And I will practice again. <laughs> but uh, y'all take a minute and think about that first month, first couple months out of retirement. And you should have it planned out, you know, for what you want to try to do, what you want to accomplish, you know, how your days are going to go. And start out with it like that. And since you've got no demands on, you can always change it later and or eliminate it altogether. Some people do better just winging it. So like me in this retirement business, I got no knowledge. I've talked with some experts. <laughs> and uh, I got a plan, but it's a loose plan and it's uh, changeable at any time I feel like it. And uh, I'm just kind of winging it. I'll have to adjust it on the fly is what I'll do. Well, that's about it. Y'all tell me y'all saw some. Y'all be good. We'll talk at you later.